you guys and welcome back to another episode of The Witcher 3. What's it called? Blood and Wine. That's what it's called. We're here to meet the, the Duchess. <laughs> okay. Okay, she's a, she's a, wow, I love her screams. Oh. All right, all right. Jesus, they're on on one today, aren't they? Hope you guys are all right. It's late, I know. He's Sorry sleeping, you, okay. But I need to talk to the Duchess. It's no trouble. I had not yet laid my head to rest. As to her illustrious highness, I fear you will have to wait until the sun has risen again. Make yourself at home. Milton mentioned you'd been to Corvo Bianco to see the beast's victim. Learn anything yeah. new from the body? I'd like the Duchess to hear what I have to say. We cannot disturb her at this hour. Well, since we have to wait anyway, steal yourself for a long story. Yeah, why not? Oh my god, that woman is still yelling. Look at her. Yeah. Interesting to see what and happens how next. how is it we passed from your account of the investigation to reminiscing about the succubus? Because those were good times. And we were younger. Always nice to talk about that. Look. Sun's up. Then let's tarry no more. Our enlightened highness is sure to have arrived at the two in the grounds by now. Let us go. Okay. Attorney? Sounds like I said attorney. Elf guardian gladiators. <laughs> Close, but not quite. As we'll soon see. Holy moly, Someone's what the heck? Some elves on its tail to confuse it, slow it down. Whatever is the problem? The beast is a gift from the Emperor, no less. Oh my god. Well, I'm surprised he still has his legs, to be honest. Okay, hold things this dangerous. Is dangerous. Yeah. Bells on its tail aren't enough. I saw a spectacle of the sort of Yorina in London. There, a knight came to the Shelma with bells on its tail. Might have gotten lucky. Shelma might have been lame. Who knows? Only a witcher has a real chance against a healthy Shelmar, and that's not even every witcher. Besides which, releasing a monster that dangerous in front of a crowd, plain irresponsible. Who's going to fight the beast? Guillaume. It's probably going to be Geralt. Knight, yeah. Mentioned he promised his heart's capture a monster trophy. Oh my god, great he's going to die. Demands great sacrifices. He's going to die. Let's go. Probably Geralt is gonna step up or something's gonna happen, I would imagine, right? I mean, I'm excited to fight that thing. Um, just as a side note, I wanted to let you guys know that I got the Grandmaster woven gear, boots, trousers, and gloves. Um, I didn't get the chest and the two swords just because I don't have enough money yet, so I'm still trying to clear the map. I just did the Gwen tournament, so that took me like two days just to complete to find all the skill I dedicate deck my cards. imminent victory to fair lady Vivian. Oh, is that her name? Oh no, the Duchess is next. Oh, she's the daughter of the Duchess? Wait, what? It's begun. The fight shall have to end first. We must wait. Oh, maybe the sister. <laughs> Wow, that looks amazing. It looks like an armadillo, right? Got a bad yeah. feeling about this. Yeah. Whoa. Oh my god. Not one. Wow. How many does he have? Two left? But the armadillo is not dead, so... Oh god, why is he celebrating? <gasps> Uh-oh. Are we gonna step in? What's gonna happen? Now the sun's out. Ouch. We have to help him. No oh, shit, I knew it! I knew he was gonna step in. He's like, ugh. Not as I, not I actually. Oh my! 
Whoa, 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 calm down, calm down. And get him because he's like okay the axe doesn't really work right flip an egg this is the trick he just to do why are you even doing any damage i'm not really Right, I'm definitely kind of. Oh shit, I forgot to dodge! The fate of the beast has been weighed by the gods! Okay. He's not really fighting because of whatever I put on my sword, I don't even know. But I mean, it's working, so... Thing is, is this correct, guys? Like, if I look at the beast cherry for something how to kill, it's not there until I kill at least one of the... One of the, like... You know, mobs, I guess? Does that really makes sense to me. Woo! He's coming. What's happening? Why is he in the ground? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Holy, holy. That guy is like dying. Okay, I think this is just stuff that's happening. He's almost dead, lol. And I'm not talking about the. This shamlock, you guys, is like... Where is Whoa. I'm trying not to kill this guy that's with me. And my sword is like kind of dead. Oh my gosh. Okay, I think I could use bombs and stuff. Should I try another one? Okay, let's try that. No, it doesn't work. <laughs> Fucking hell, this doesn't work. This guy's gonna die if I don't stop it. Stop! Oh my god, he's dead. He's dead! Oh my god! I can't believe I messed that up. I didn't want him to die. I just didn't know how to stop it. I get that the, the grape shot didn't really like go on him. How the I don't know. Okay, I'm not gonna mm, I'm a bit pissed now. Honestly, I've been doing so good in the main gameplay, and now I'm fucking up all the DLCs. Or both of them. Rithia, master of the witchering trade. <sighs> Behold, as the last gasps of life seep from the beast. Don't cheer me. I fucking let the other guy die. And intentionally. Master Geralt, do what you must. Finish the deed. Okay, let's kill it. It suffered enough. Why would you fail? Anyway? The fight is done. Christ be the victors.
Forgive me. I am not as nimble as in my younger years. You found Oh, he's not dead? Thanks for your help. Holy shit. Or is that the guy that died? Damned close to dying. Oh, they're not dead. Oh my Fine. god, okay. Oh, thank god. It's hurt at all. Vivian? Smile as befits a hero and keep silent. Speech clearly paints you. She approaches. Mm. Wow, they're also Geralt. beautiful. We must talk. Vivian, you shall talk later in the medic's tent. Geralt, magnificent, breathtaking. Your grace. We knew that to summon you was a brilliant idea. We are delighted, raffish, to have struck upon it. And I'm truly uh, honored. <gasps> See to our young she hero. Disappointed. Hop, hop. For we must make off with Geralt. We should talk. We had oh, I'm wondering if she's gonna be a romance. Had nearly lost hope. Interest. Then suddenly, that entrance, so spectacular. Great. Your grace. Shalemars are dangerous creatures, even to knights in full plate armor. Nonsense. In Toussaint, knights have battled beasts for mere glory since time immemorial. True. Guillaume suffered a few bumps, scars, and bruises. But in return, gained eternal glory as he who slew the monster. Mm -hmm. What about the crowd? Say the Shalemar had vaulted into the stands. Would have been a massacre. Geralt, though we value your fortuitous intervention in the arena, we would remind you your services have been retained. And as shall soon become clear, you will be generously compensated for completing oh, another okay. task altogether. Sure. Your grace, my contract. I'd like to discuss it. Naturally, but not here. We shall need Damien. He let the investigation pending your arrival. But whoever could he be? Come, we must find him. So I think actually dead. I'm pretty sure we killed it, but... Hmm. I wonder why it like zoomed on it or not zoom, but you know, I don't know. I'm just so confused because <laughs> I think I'm making the good decisions in this one, but I'm clearly not. My intuition is way off. Have you come alone or did Viscount Julian accompany you? Wish to see Dandelion, your grace? Yes. I mean, no. Dandelion? <sighs> yes, but solely to tell him we regret. Yes, deeply yeah. regret rescinding the death sentence we so justly handed down upon him. If we could turn back time, we would make certain he sat in a tower till he rotted. No, we would ensure he was broken on the wheel, then drawn, hanged, and quartered. Yeah. Ah, the very man we would entrust with these tasks. Damien de la Tour, captain of my personal guard. Your Grace. Witcher. Greetings. Sorry to have to tell you, but the guardsmen handling the last victim's body... I know already. The creature in the cellar of Corpo Bianco. Was it the beast? No. A bruxa. A kind of vampire. Not the beast, but tied to it in some way. Hmm. You know this how? Through careful analysis of the evidence, both on the riverbank and at Corvo Bianco. Do you mean to insinuate the investigation thus far has been sloppy? Geralt insinuates nothing of the sort. We must listen to him attentively. Yeah, you I heard the lady. the body of the beast's last victim. Might have found something. Need to analyze it. A quiet place. That's what I could use most right now. And maybe the help of an alchemist or a mage. Also like to hear all you know about the previous victims. Take it Sir De La Tour is my man for that. Firstly, call me Damien, please. Secondly, you should know I spoke against summoning you here. I've heard much about you. You bring trouble, or thus far have, always. And we've enough trouble as it is. Yet we are capable of defeating the beast on our own, without an outsider's help. I've no doubt about it. Damien, we settled the matter of the Witcher's employ some time past. Definitively. 
since you have broached it nonetheless. Let us discuss Geralt's pay. Oh, Are okay, I need true? a lot. Do witchers usually demand that which you find at home, yet did not expect? Uh, let's go. Yes, yes, your grace. The law of surprise. Time honored. Hmm. We shall be counted. The surprises we encounter on a daily basis would be of no value to one such as you. What awaits at the palace are edicts to sign and portraits of suitors from far off lands. I fear you would find little use for either. Thus, we've decided right. you shall receive the deed to a vineyard, Corvo Bianco, and Whoa. a sum of coin. You will doubtless consider this adequate. Oh my Title God. to the vineyard shall be given to you at once. Surely you'll need lodgings while you hunt. The coin, however, will be yours only once you have slain the beast. Lovely, right. generous gesture, your grace. But Corvo Bianco, isn't it the duchy's temporary morgue? Is it now? The chancellery is bungled things again, we fear. Not to be left unsupervised for one instant. Yet, in its mood, a morgue should present minimal problems to a witcher. What's mm -hmm. more, nothing enhances a wine's reputation better than a grim legend. Thank you, Your Grace. Mm -hmm. I accept well. the contract, of course. But as I said before, I'll need some information. Okay, let's see. Tell me How about the first start? victim. Sorry about that weird cut, victim? you guys. Crispy was the first to die. He was famed once for his many glorious tournament victories. Then he grew old, hung up his sword, and took to winemaking. Crespi was not loved by the wine merchants. He was ruthless in business and thought to cheat many a time. He asked us for a dispensation from all court ceremonies. We did not grant it. We could not. Once you've taken the oath of a knight, you remain a knight till death. How'd he die? Where'd they find the body? Quite unusual, the circumstance. He was at a feast when suddenly one of his fellow feast goers noticed he was missing. Oh. The town watch found him an hour later. On his hands and knees, propped against the town pillory, his sword hanging from his neck. He had died of wounds inflicted with claws, not a weapon. Blows of great force. So he oh. died suddenly, but the body was on its knees, meaning someone posed it. So it seems. Right, okay. So, first two victims were knights, best years behind them. The same could be said of the third. Sir Delacroix was wont to claim that in modern times, knights face new challenges. Enterprise being the latest addition to the chivalric virtues. He made a veritable fortune in the grain trade. Palmerin even nicknamed him Sir de la Stinchi. Found a coin pouch on oh. his body. Contained florins dating from various times. Hailing That's from different right. provinces of the Empire. Delacroix loved coin, true, but had no patience for numismatics. Mm. Lots of similarities between the victims. All the bodies were found in strange places under extraordinary circumstances. Seems the murderer, whoever or whatever it is, has some meaning to convey. These yeah. were honorable men. We are horrified by the disdain, the disrespect with which they were treated. These were knights of Toussaint. Blast it. Might be the point. From what you say, none was a model of virtue. Ever considered that's what the beast's trying to draw attention to? All the mm. murdered men were knights who swore fealty to the five chivalric virtues. And even if the- Knights of Toussaint swear fealty to what virtues exactly? Honor, wisdom, generosity, valor and compassion. Right. Five virtues. Why are they so important to your knights? Strange question. Your Grace, forgive me. I'm a foreigner trying to understand another land's customs. You are forgiven. According to legend, the virtues we cultivate were bestowed upon us by the Lady of the Lake. How oh. we truly came to espouse them, none remember. In Toussaint, we believe men of low birth should be simple-hearted and obedient. We expect much more, however, of our knights. Hmm. They are to be soldiers and courtiers, lords and servants. Thus, the need for clear moral guidelines. At the time of his dubbing, a knight vows to demonstrate throughout his life honor, wisdom, generosity, valor, and compassion. Okay. Beast seems to be pointing up moral decay, denouncing it. Victims yeah. were all humiliated. 
might have been murdered to emphasize their lack of specific chivalric virtues. Honor compromised by the pillory. Wisdom by ridicule. Generosity by a coin pouch shoved down a throat. It seems to fit, true, though not perfectly. Can't discount mm. the theory if it's on the lips of everyone in town. Say our reasoning's right. Next murder will be just as showy and denounce the victim's lack of the fourth virtue, valor. We can also assume that victim will be an elder knight. Let's think. At the moment, all the knights are either at the tourney grounds or in the palace gardens. Our annual hare hunt shall begin there shortly. Have you heard of the custom? Milton mentioned something. Seemed excited to prance around in a bunny costume. Not oh, sure yeah. Why. <laughs> Hang on. Strange circumstances. A knight advanced in years. The famed cowardice of rabbits. Could it be that simple? Is Milton de Peyrac Peyren the next victim? Milton also knew Delacroix. Told me so down by the river. Damien! Ooh. To me, something so obvious. De Peyrac Peyren, Crespi, Delacroix, and De Lac formed the knightly team. It was years ago, but. Oh, okay. They were, a team. They were close friends, tightly knit, and as such, earned the trust of our father, the Duke. We often witnessed him turn to them with delicate matters. Later, their paths diverged. Unlikely to be a coincidence. Beast yeah. must know it too. It's a lead, I'm sure. Okay. Your Grace, we need to find Melton immediately. Rather problematic. You see, the garden entertainments are due to start, and he's disguised as the hare, hiding somewhere, waiting for some tipsy courtiers to find him. The hare's hiding place is a carefully guarded secret. We must call off the game at once. First and foremost, we must remain calm. Damien, order the garden searched immediately, but discreetly. By no means can we disrupt the festivities. Panic will only incite the beast to strike sooner. That's true. And you, Witcher, follow me. My gardens, my night, I shall take the fall. A murder is out of the question. I will not allow it. Not near my palace. Horses? Uh, Ready our horses. I'm pretty sure we're gonna find him dead. Just have a feeling that that's gonna happen. But I like where this is going, to be fair, so. That's good. Oh. What she do? Your Grace! <gasps> What's she doing? She ripped her dress. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> wow. She's a savage. Classy. Bougie. Nasty. What the hell? Why, I should. Your Highness, I. Mind it doesn't get wrinkled. <laughs> Mind it doesn't get wrinkled. <laughs> Alert! <laughs> Ooh, I like myself a woman like her. Mm -hmm. Hey, that is silk. Be careful. Give it to me. Why won't he let go anyway? He's probably the person that kills everybody. Imagine. That would be a really big turn of events. So where are they going exactly? In the gardens, they said. Okay. Ooh. Let's hope he... I have a feeling we're gonna find him dead and he's not gonna be the last that we're gonna find dead but yeah I mean I know this DLC is a lot longer than the other one so well yeah uh, oh my goodness you your grace seems out. right at home right in the saddle the oh, her lady the Jutus clear the way I said the Duquesa. Is this part of the game? <laughs> Is this part of the game? I don't think so, but yeah. Why would they kill the knights though? That's the other thing. Okay. It's here! Just round the corner! Hurry! Okay. We must go to where the game is being held. The participants must find a unicorn's horn, a golden fish, and a phoenix egg. With oh. these in hand, they can deduce where the hare, Milton, hides. Me and right. Me to find those things too. We've no other option. But time oh goodness. What was it? I can't even remember what they said. A peg or something? Peg? Mm, maybe not. On second thought, through here. 
I shall show you where the hunt plays out. Then we will split up. Right. You will get hold of the unicorn horn and the golden fish. Unicorn horn, golden fish, right. Well, I nap the phoenix egg. That will be quickest. Right, okay, golden fish, unicorn horn. The unicorn, how do I catch it? It's terribly skittish, true, but I'm sure you will find a way to earn its trust. It runs around over there, look. All oh, right. Oh, it's a horse with the unicorn. Golden okay. fish. Do I need a rod or a net? Please, Geralt. It's not a real fish. What is it? Look there, towards the water. See the lights? The hunters are trying to hook the fish from boats. You must simply dive in and find it. Right, okay. The Colton fish and the horn both contain things or clues that will help us find Milton. Once okay. you have fish and horn, find me among the other Phoenix egg hunters. All clear? Then let's get to it. Okay, um, so they're all quite fictional, right? I mean, the golden fish isn't, but I get the meaning behind it because it's he's a, you know, like a lucky thing, isn't he? Lucky charm, whatever. Okay, it's gonna be interesting. Deadly thirsty. Retrieve the gold. I think we should do this first. Do we? No, we're what closest to the unicorn, actually. What other part of this thing would want okay, so I take her right here, and it should be fine. Earn the unicorn's trust. How no the flip it egg? <laughs> right, let's see. I can't believe she had a fling with dandelion as well. I'm like, mm. Perhaps an apple will work. Or some sweets. We would not be in this predicament, dear sister. Were you still a virgin? <gasps> Do you really wish to have this conversation again? <laughs> Here what? and now? Hush, or you'll spook the beast. We shall try the sweets. Hey, folks. Gonna have to ruin your fun. Sorry. Who's that? Is he gonna use Axie? I would imagine. Uh-oh. Is it gonna go good? Nope, it's not. He's spooked, Magook. So, he... Come on, stay calm. You do what you sent us to treat. Okay. Did I do it? Wait. Wait. Shh. Calm down. Easy now. There you go. Got one. Got your hat. Or now you have well, your unicorn that's hardly thing. Fair. Flagrant cheating is what it is. Sirs, we must teach this scamp some. Oh my god, now I have to fight them. No, let's go. Listen, with it. I didn't break any rules. True. He won fair and square. <laughs> we were unlucky. That's all. Oh my god, if only I had Axie. Who's clapping and why are they clapping? Okay, the fish is next. Gardens are huge. Be better off on the horseback. Unworthy. Do you think we're better off on a horseback? We're almost there though, so I'm not quite sure where the fishes are. We need to go down here. Whoa. Okay. Almost there. Where exactly? Golden fish should be oh my god, in this whole there. area? What's here? Wow. What the okay. faces? Very, very beautiful. Sure. If you're a peasant. What's this? Is this it? Well, why can't I get it, please? Why can't I get it? It's pissing me off. Is that it? Come on. Oh my god. Why can't I get it? It will not my do. Mistake. So how, which, Swim how, on, good man. Well, so many questions, but how do I know which one's which? Nope, not that. Not that. We got one there. Okay, let's see if we can swim faster. Faster, faster, faster. Candy. That thing. 
didn't get it. Oh, there's one more there. I think, is it? Where have I been? Oh, I think this is it. Yes. Oh, gosh. Oh, hello? Did somebody just catch it? Hey, wait. Stop. It's important. If he's a killer, maybe he knows it's important. And he's trying to stop us. Maybe it's somebody in our immediate King vicinity. Oh. Sire, accept this offering we bring. Prithee cast upon us your merciful eye and bear before us its secrets. As the moon is heavenly course doth trace, in my domain I await that moment of grace when a soul of good or ill repute brings me a gift, fitting tribute. <laughs> He's like, G give me that. Oh my god, Geralt, no manners at all. A okay, key. a key. <laughs> You're crying now. Okay, uh, I'll meet you guys there, I guess. Meet the Duchess. Right, guys, you're here. Let's see where the Duchess is. There she is. Ooh. Let's hope she found the Phoenix. I guess maybe we if have to please, do that too. Your grace. We do not please. We act out of the highest necessity. Or shall be explained later. But it's against the rules. I am the rules. Ooh. Geralt! At last. Let's hope we're not too late. I've another. Show me yours. Oh. Who wrote this drivel? I begin like a groan, hollowed out with ease, then end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. Uh, in a cave? It's a green some got no idea where Molten's hiding. Oh my god, so I begin like a groan, hollowed out with ease. Then end like a mouse with a head of hard cheese. I would say it's a cave. Groans, hollows. Could be a cave, I guess. Now that's just silly. Is it? Look, if we take groan, hollow it out and fill it with ease. The letters, that is. We get green. Greenhouse. Then mouse, but starting with what heads hard cheese. Why, it's greenhouse. Hmm, pretty clever. And it sounds right to me. There are several greenhouses in the gardens, but oh, only one God. with a door that locks. And the key right. to it looks just like the one we found. Right. Let's go. Okay, at least we know. I bet you were gonna find him dead. I bet you. It's just how this game pans out, like everybody dies. Is that Geralt? <laughs> Obviously, because he's a main. Wait here. She's like, oh, how dare you? I want to see. I'm the Duchess. Mm. <gasps> I knew he was dead. I knew it. Oh my god, oh, I'm chase him. What, what the, the heck? Butch. Whoa, oh, he looks cool as a. I thought what was that? They couldn't be in the sunshine, but I don't know. Whoa. He reminds me of Olgierd. He had that sort of ability, right? This is amazing. It's like a movie. Oh god, we're gonna have to fight him. I don't have that. Better gear, I'm still grinding for the swords and chest piece armor. Yeah, we're gonna fight him here. I don't think we're gonna maybe it's not him him, maybe there's like a multitude of guys that do it. I don't know. I said in the first episode I know it's about vampires for sure, so blood and wine makes sense. I'm here. Oh. I don't wanna fight you, okay, personally. This belong to you maybe? It did, but you it may did. keep it. I've a new one. I do not know you. I've done you no harm. Yet right. first you butchered a Bruxer who was dear to me. Now you pursue me. Why? You've killed four innocent people, at least. 
And you? How many innocents have you cut down? Fair point. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not here to talk about me. Yet, that is exactly what we are doing. So, did they send you after me? Who are they? What do you mean, they? Duchess hired me. You've been murdering her subjects. <laughs> is it as simple as that? I would ask you to convey to the Duchess that I've but one victim left, but you'll not get the chance. Oh, great. <laughs> really? Oh, I don't want to fight him. Okay, I've got oils. Okay, wait. <laughs> I've got oils. Draconoid oil? Do I have it? Like, wait. I'm tripping now. Okay, what oils do I have? Superior? I'm pretty sure. Vampire oil? Attacks power versus vampires. Okay, so yes, do this. We have draconoid as well, but I draconoid versus draconoids. Okay, so he's a vampire, I think. Oh! Black blood. Um. Um, Basilisk, I don't think I've got anything for a vampire anymore. No. So. That won't help me. Golden Oriole. Blizzard, no. Tawny potion. Okay, so let's go, I guess. Okay, I'm scared. I am not really going to make it. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god! Chill! Chill! Fuck, you know. I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna... He's fucking powerful. Oh my god. Am I dead? Or is this meant to happen? It's meant to happen. I think. Yikes. Wait, what? You were to stay where you were. Regenerate. I know you're in trouble. I can help. I'll help myself. No, he's my friend. What? What is happening? He's yes, my friend. Girl, it's Who me. is he? Regis? I, you all right? All is well. All's in order. I Wounds don't know such who as he is. these heal on vampires in moments. But we've not seen one another in ages, my friend. At least in human terms, that is. How's this even possible? Last I saw you. We... I was a bubbling, shapeless smear, having been rather spectacularly melted into a column of a certain castle. In somewhat oh. better shape now, as you can see. Hardly peak four, mind you, but were I human, folk would think me a demigod, I dare say. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. What happened? It was my fault. Never got a chance to apologize. Oh, no need, Geralt. What Bygones. happened? I need to know. I did not have to join you on that expedition. No one twisted my arm. I genuinely, if this happened in this gameplay, like, I'm dumb. But I don't think it, it, it did, right? Miraculous regeneration. How do you manage it? I had help. From the one you hunt. Him? How? And what have you been doing all these years? Not the time nor place for such stories. I suspect we'll get a chance to speak at ease and at length later. Now, however, we must deal with the reason that brought us both here. Yeah. Killer I'm hunting seems you know him. What brings you back after all these years? So you being here, it's no coincidence? Your powers of deduction seem to have waned not one bit. I'm happy. I came here for Tetlaf. I fear he's become entangled, landed himself in serious trouble. 
So that's his name. Right. He's your friend? You might call it that. Though Detlaf is, how would you humans put it, more bestial than I am. But not to worry. I'm working on him. Haven't exactly done a great job with that. He's killed one night since I got here, at least three others before I arrived. For good reason, I'm sure. Understand, Detlaf is not some decadent shit who kills for sport, or to assuage a dryness of throat or a dullness of mood. Okay, how can you be so sure? Seem pretty damn sure of that. I am, because I know him very well. Despite appearances to the contrary, you two are quite alike. You've both oh. noble hearts, yet you both are wont to perform ignoble deeds. When circumstances force you to, of course. Hmm. Remember the year 964? <laughs> that was three centuries ago. Blind fear Whoa. gripped Rivia, Lyria, and Spala. Women and children were dying. Their mutilated, dismembered corpses littered the fields. Brute of Lyria. How old he is. Read about it. Chewed up almost 200, then fell Whoa. to a common poacher supposedly armed with a dagger blessed by some prophet. It fell to Detlaf, who then found a poacher asleep in the brush near his snares and dropped the fiend's corpse at his feet. And thus, a legend was born. Huh. Hmm. Huh. Vampires rarely help humans. Must have had his own agenda hunting the beast. You err. He slew it for one reason alone. The monster killed a lad who once in the street had offered Detlaf an apple, expecting nothing in return. Terribly noble of him. You do not mm. have a monopoly on altruism, my friend. Vilgefort melted my body. Detlaf found what was left. As per our codex, he had a choice. To leave me where I was, or to care for me and nurture my remains. He chose the latter. Regenerated me at no small expense in his own blood. Oh. Do you know what that means to a vampire? The gravity of the endeavor? Probably same thing it means to a human. You owe him your life. Right. But much more than that. The act itself made us blood brethren. A bond so strong humans cannot even imagine. Hmm. Which is why I know something ill is afoot. Always had an overdeveloped sense of empathy. Each vampire has a unique talent. One they hone over centuries. It's precisely what renders us so difficult to classify. Detlaf's trump card is his herd instinct, his tribal propensity. In point of fact, he prefers the company of lesser vampires and shuns that of humans. If right. he walks among you, killing egregiously, it can only mean something's upset him immensely. Mm. Anything specific? Some set of things that would be likely to set him off? How should I say this? Detlaf doesn't understand men. Their world, its rules, its conventions. He's naive, in a sense. He doesn't comprehend your games, knows not what it means to lie, deceive. Huh. Suggesting oh. he's maladjusted, inventing his rage. I'm suggesting maladjustment can at times breed conflict. But is it the case this time? I cannot say, but intend to find out. Okay. Gotta find him. At least we have a lead. Before something upsets him even more, and all Beau Claire is awash with blood. Hmm. Well, we share a cause then, just like the old days. Not entirely. I mean, when I find him, you know. I know you've a contract on his head. Yet your true task is to stop the beast killing, not necessarily to kill the beast, am I right? All in all, sure. Let us find him. By the time we do, I hope I'll have convinced you Detlaf is no monster. Fine, Ooh, all right okay. already. But for now, evidence is stacking up against him. True. Hear that? The posse. Knights must have tracked me here. I'd prefer they not find me here. I'd make shift quarters at Mela Shay's Long Cemetery. We'll meet there. See you. Right. It's a good way to fly, I guess. Or teleport, or not. It's Witcher, not teleportation. We flew here as fast as our courses would carry us. Yet I fear we're late all the same. Pray. Where is the beast? Still investigating. About to inspect this site. Withdraw your men before they trample all over the evidence. Ahem, <clears throat> sirs. We must let the Witcher do his work. Milton's murder cannot go unoffensed. Oh, God. 
It's a, it's an awkward position for Geralt to be in. He's in between like an old friend and these new guys that actually hired him. So, uh, you know, like, what do you do? I should have meditated actually. I don't know why I'm wasting my time with Enhanced Swallow, but I will leave it here with you for now. Um, I'm excited to see what happens next. Honestly, I didn't think I would like Blood and Wine better than um, Hearts of Stone. Because the story and all the quests were so amazing. But this one just blew me away. Not only because of the new map, but like it's very interesting. I mean, obviously you guys know I'm Romanian. And vampires are traditionally known to be from Romania. You know, Dracula and whatnot. Vlad Tepes or Vlad the Impaler or whatever. So... I just want to relay a fun fact. Actually, the high school and the primary school that I've been to, it was called Vladi Impaler. So I thought that was cool. Anyway, I feel very connected to the game at the moment, as you can tell. So yeah, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll uh, meet you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.